Well, hello. This is uh, a video about pressure gauges. So this uh, is actually a replacement gauge that we had. We already had one gauge go out on us a few years back when it got cold outside and froze. Well, again, we had more freezing weather here in Texas. And again, we have another bad pressure gauge. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn this off uh, so you can see what I mean by bad pressure gauge. So now with the pump turned off, uh, it's still reading about, what is that, 47 or so PSI, which it's definitely not. It's actually pretty simple. You just uh, unscrew it, put some Teflon tape on it uh, to make sure it's got a good seal and doesn't leak, and screw the new one in. So this is just a cheap pressure gauge I got off of uh, Amazon for less than 10 bucks. I'll put a, a link down there. But um, it's going to work for what I need. Basically, mine needs this... Uh, one fourth inch thread uh, in the back of the pressure gauge to screw in to my pull filter and uh, just needs to go up to 60 psi so we're going to go ahead and and put this in and uh, see what it's reading after I get a new gauge in all right so I'll put a little uh, thread seal around there as you can see around the threads don't need a lot just once or twice around it that's good enough to, to make a good seal and then I'm going to come up here and these are snug but you don't want to put them on too tight don't use like pliers to grip them unscrew it so now I get the new one and to try to not strip the threads you don't want to go too crazy with it but I would like to get it straight let me see if I get it one more turn. All right, there I go. Now it's uh, it's in there. It's nice and straight. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and kick the pull pump on. All right, pull pump's running. As you can see, I'm getting about, I don't know, 31, 32 PSI. That's actually pretty decent. All right, and that uh, that's it. Now it's got a new pressure gauge, of course. <laughs> If we have another freeze in Texas, since again we don't winterize, then I'll probably be replacing it again. Alright, well hopefully if this video was helpful, you know, uh, like the video, subscribe to the channel, do all that fun stuff that really helps us out. And uh, until the next time, y'all take care.